Hi guys, in this video we will discuss how to create a numpy array filled with ones using the numpy.ones function. Python's numpy module provides a function to create a numpy array of given size and shape but all values in it will be initialized to one. So it accepts three different arguments. First one is the shape like the shape of the numpy array which we want to create it can be a single integer or a sequence of integers single integer if you want to create a one dimensional numpy array filled with ones sequence of integers if you want to create a multi dimension array filled with ones second argument is an optional argument d type that is the data type of the elements or the data type of the ones by default it's a float but you can change it if you want to create a ones of different data type like integers third argument is the order it's an optional argument and it represents the order in which data will be stored in the multi-dimension array that is in row measure or column measure by default it is column measure but it's an optional argument so let's now use the numpy.ones function to create a numpy array filled with one. First of all, we will import the numpy module as np. You can import it as with any other name also. But generally, it's like a gold standard to import is as np. Because in all the reference document, in all the tutorials on the web, in all the books, you will find it as np. So it's easy to coordinate or like it's easy to understand. So we will create numpy.ones and inside it we've passed five so it will create a numpy array of five ones we can confirm it so it returned a numpy array five ones but all the type of the elements in these are float we can assign it to a variable also and then we can check the type of the variable here irr we can print the content we can print the type also it's nd array so it created a numpy array of ones but what if we want to create a numpy array of integer ones only not the float ones in that case we can pass the second argument which is an optional one like d type because by default it uses float but we can ask it to use integer like here okay we forgot to pass the comma okay so it created a numpy array filled with ones as integers. So till now we created one dimensional numpy array filled with ones. But what if we want to create two dimensional numpy array a kind of matrix filled with ones? We can easily do that by passing the sequence of integers like four rows and five columns. So it will return a two dimensional numpy array filled with float ones there are four rows and five columns so let's make it integer type d type np dot int 64 so it created a matrix of in ones as integers so here we created a two dimensional numpy array so we can also create a t three dimensional numpy array or n dimensional numpy array if you want or let's say two so it will return a three dimensional number array. So this is how we can use numpy.ones to create a numpy array filled with ones only. Thanks for watching and do subscribe our channel for more videos like this.